back it up and put it on me. <laughs> there he goes again. <laughs> Woo. What is up, everybody? Thank you for checking out the DMHP pod, the Deuterman Homie Bro podcast. We're all here. Hey, Patrick Christopher, uh, with my special guest, uh, Jacob Fortes, <laughs> Scott Ramos, <laughs> and King Quasi. Um, you know, black people have a stigma <laughs> about being late. Back in the building. Yeah, he was on time. Who, what are you who, talking about? Who shut that down today? Yeah. yeah. One. Boom. And who made us the Boom. new them? Making moves for my people. Yeah, who, change it up. Hey, who made us the new them? You know what? I'm sorry for the reparations. We haven't got to them yet, but, you know, black lives matter. I love black women. I think we just exposed the new truth. I'm here to support. You know, some people don't know that side of America, <laughs> which is late Hispanic people. <laughs> They it was my know. fault. I was late. I was Duh. late. Late Latinos. I was you know late. <laughs> late like a Latina. Where are they? Where are they? For Where are sure. they? Is there one next living next to you? You don't know. You don't know. <laughs> if he's in the driveway after 8 30, he's one of them. He, he is. That's so funny, know. dude. Late Latinos. Uh, I don't yeah. know if you heard the last podcast we were talking about how to, I had a boss or a supervisor rather who uh Made me quit my job because I asked to go on break. And he goes, why are you such a fucking stereotype? <laughs> and now we got the lateness. We're just like, we're taking over your, your stuff. Your boss man. asked you why you was a stereotypical Mexican? No, like, because I wanted to go on break. He's like, why are you such a fucking stereotype? I was like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> I didn't get angry didn't... at first, but like it, after it set in, after we played a couple of times in my head, I was like, I think that was. Because uh, what about you is stereotypical about that? Like, that he wanted a break. Because you want a break? Because yeah. I, go I think not taking a break would be stereotypical. Right? That's hey. <laughs> But all <laughs> I'm saying, like, hey, hey, you want to take a break, Patrick? Yeah. No, I'm just going to work right through it because. Yeah. <laughs> it's in my blood. It's, it's, <laughs> the, the, you know who the Aztecs are? <laughs> <laughs> Patrice O'Neill called them ancient dishwashers. <laughs> <laughs> Never late, no breaks. That's, That's wild. Should be our thing. That is un-American. Let's make it happen. Yeah. Un-American as um, well. All right, so I, came, I, I brought you here to ask you the real questions. One, black people, why do you not hit the bong? Boom. First of all, jumping right in. Crack epidemic. Okay, let's, let's go. You there. know what? I have heard that. Let's go there. But that, I thought that was that specifically more, just his. That's more influential than the time before that. Maybe the time before that in the 70s and the 60s, you might have found black people doing that. Yeah. But the 80s changed the game. You know what I'm saying? So in like the 90s, all that crack changed the game. So it's too much like that. Like as far as that's how that's how you view it. Yeah. Yeah. Really? Like if you, yeah. Like especially those little one hitter bombs y'all be having. I say y'all loosely. Um, I don't spot as, culturally, because <laughs> yeah. I know you know you know little comics they'll walk around with them yeah. in their pocket, pull them out the little one, yeah, the little yeah. dugout, yeah, the little yeah, yeah. That's what Penny got. It That's looked too much like it looked too much like a crack pipe. Interesting, dude. I never even thought about that. So you never like used a bong? I've hit so, a bong before, but it was like a big one. Yeah, you want to do it? Another you're, one? You're opposed to bongs? I'm not opposed to. I just have to be in a comf- I have to be in a place of comfort with that, people I'm comfortable with that I know for a fact don't do crack you know what I'm saying like, <laughs> so like took- that's got that's a prerequisite <laughs> because once you get me to hit the ball you get you know they taught me but I come from the dare time it's a gateway yeah. and so yeah it's a gateway drug so you might try to open the gate after you hit me to hit the ball like hey you like the ball well here's a different type of ball <laughs> You See, don't, even, you don't I, even need water for this one. You know what I'm saying? Just put the fire right, right there's here. There's too many gateways here and too yeah. many back gateways. Too many here. gates and ways. And, <laughs> no. I always assumed it was like, because it was like a phallic thing. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> and so like, you're like, no homo. <laughs> you know, pause. <laughs> you know? Phallic? Is that what you said? Phallic. Phallic? Yeah. That's Dude, why people know, love hot dogs? I didn't even know that word existed until today. Phallic. I, I didn't even know right. what that means. Uh, oh, it's a penis. Yeah, so. phallic okay. like symbols. Okay, no, it's yeah. definitely not that. Have you ever been to Atlanta? <laughs> You're like, it's definitely not that. <laughs> I mean, have you, ever been to, have you ever been to Atlanta? Yes. Yeah. Okay. And, and for a while I was there. All right. So it was, you know, yeah, it was, you know how it much was, they it love was freak penis. Nick. You know what I'm saying? Like, and they're not ashamed of it at all. Explain that culture has existed forever. <laughs> it's just now open and like, you know, it's comfortable. I remember a time, look, my mom had gay friends, right? It was like a little gay section in North Carolina where my people live. <laughs> mm-hmm. And like, they would hang out on the weekends. It wasn't no secret. Like, so th- that is not. <laughs> <laughs> Some black men been loving dick a long time. Can I say that on your show? 
No, <laughs> God no. We only speak the truth here. So right. yeah, man. Yeah, I don't know what type of platform this was. Oh uh, man, like we were trying. I'm not to, familiar. We were trying to hold steady. Oh, thanks for supporting the pod. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we were trying to hold steady with like the like, don't cuss, don't say certain things, and I'm just like, I don't think it matters. I well, think it matters. I think if you're on a certain platform, and it's. Like now, once we get monetized, that's once different. We, then we'll be like, then our, you're gonna sell out. That, yo, I'll sell out real quick, dude. <laughs> I'll sell out today. We have a thing. I don't. I, I don't think we put it out yet. But like, uh, I promised. I got them involved. That if we get to a thousand subscribers on YouTube before your college shirt before the end of the uh, year, <laughs> uh, we'll do a shirtless podcast. That's not. That's, he that's said that not, on the podcast. Look, I, I remember not, that podcast. That's not the direction you want to go in professionalism. You know, you know what I'm saying? Like I. I was thinking more of the lanes of, hey, if you get a thousand views, you would dress up. Like, I'll be more professional. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, nah, we're going to strip it nah, down. I'll be a whore. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All right, all right. I see where you're going. So we will get, <laughs> we'll get dressed up and gradually get naked. If okay, we get take to your time one, with it as, yeah, a, we'll as the episode goes Well, because my, my thing was like, okay, we'll put out a podcast. It'll be like the shortest episode ever. But like, we'll do a podcast, you with know. With no shirts on. No shirts. Everybody or just you, dude? Everybody. You I'm not going by myself. I'm not going. You, yeah, you are. <laughs> you and Scott. So are you? Are you, are you sold? Are they sold are on the strip right idea? now, bro? Nah. I mean, Jacob might be because he's in a different place in his life. <laughs> yeah. Um. So then, he's like, I've been dying to take my shirt off, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know, man. I'm just like sex sells. I think. <laughs> Um, we can make a calendar uh, make of us in poses. You know? only, like how many are y'all like shirtless? How many months? You know what I'm saying? Like the months and the people on the I show. I would never do a calendar. See, that's the, the math kind of doesn't work a no. little bit. Yeah, I got like you. Yeah. It's only three months in this room right now. No, that's four pictures. So you said they got to see you in different months. Yo, let me be a cop one. <laughs> you know, just be my eight by ten like I was an actor. At least show them all their faces with cut. You, be, you can do a guest a, spot. We'll have you in you'll February. You'll be a pilgrim in February. Yeah. It's oh, like, oh, where'd you get this pilgrim geez. picture? Yeah. From? I'll do June. Yeah, yeah that is why, gay month. Why, why do you feel qualified to do June? Because he's yeah. half gay. Yeah. Because you had sex with a black woman? Yes. Yeah. Cocoa How about butter. you, Patrick? Have you ever had sex with a black woman? No, I kissed one You're definitely out. I kissed one once. I kissed one once. You might could do February. It just didn't February. happen. It just didn't happen. Well, Scott, I know you You have, right? Definitely. Pat grew up like yes, a Bronx no. tail. Like, it wasn't allowed. It was not It was frowned upon back then. It wasn't frowned upon. We just couldn't. <laughs> just couldn't. They used the N-word with, with the O at the end. How the Spanish people do. <laughs> <laughs> Negrito. <is it? laughs> no, nah, man. I just, we just. Scott, we, we I'm just assuming never. you have. Oh, yeah. You are oh, you haven't. Uh, if you haven't, you, said you so might be. Look, I, look he, I feel like you might be racist now. You know what I'm saying? No. It's like how you grow up with a black best friend and don't have sex with a black. Bro, uh, a younger black woman. A younger. I was black younger. Woman? A younger Mexican male. Okay. That was the first one that uh, ate my ass. That's disrespectful. Wow. That, <laughs> that that's forever in love. That, uh, like, why would you put it in that context? Yeah. Like, okay. <laughs> you got to respect uh, yeah, that. Were I supposed to say it romantically? Know, first, like, first, how do you word the that? The first person who did some filthy, nasty <laughs> shit to me no. was actually a black woman. Yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. Nah, man. That was wrong, dude. You don't have to say all that. <laughs> yeah, that was terrible, dog. You, you could have you said yes. It was a yes or no question, so, dog. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you were writing an essay about you, it. Do you remember when I lost my pants? Oh, damn, this is going to turn bad. Never mind. <laughs> this is all going to turn bad. All right, This whole ahead. episode is just already in the dumpster. How did we get here? That would have, woof. Yeah, she was the first girl that let me pee on her. I remember. Yeah. Come on, man. Oh. Yeah, I did date a black girl one time. Yeah. This girl who sucked my toes. <laughs> <laughs> this <was> disgusting. <laughs> no. The only one I ever dated. No. Oh, I was just having this. Uh, oh, you said date? I, that, that, I feel like that's even more disrespectful because you don't even want to give her that title. Oh, no. If y'all didn't go nowhere, though, I guess it's not a No. Y'all didn't go Is it nowhere? more disrespectful to pee or cheat on someone? I guess it depends on what they're into. If they're into... What if they're into both? <laughs> they're into neither. both. It's not disrespectful. That's like and a trifecta. who is she? Yeah. <laughs> I had to do it. To save the marriage, I have to do it. <laughs> Dog, that's a wild feeling. It's that old Patrice bit. To ever... To just say, hey, I want to feel the warm urine coming out of you. Would time. you? Um, I just had this. I just asked a girl this question last night. Like, would you let a dude pee on your feet for like a grand a day for like a couple of weeks? You know what I mean? <laughs> Wait, and what? she was quick to say yes. Yeah. So they have to let that happen. Every day of the every week? day they do it, they get yeah. a grand. Every, every day. day they do it, they get a grand. Yeah. But it's only on the feet. 
Only on the feet. Just yeah. Piss on the time feet. me up, bro. Right? So, reverse <laughs> question, right? I feel like guys pull the trigger right away. Scott? Uh, I, you, I think I need to, to think on this a little longer. Would you, would you pee on a woman's feet for $1,000? Oh, yeah. In a heartbeat. Okay. Would you let a woman pee on your feet that's for $1,000? That's where, you know, I got it. That's what the, that's what the, the, that's the conundrum what the is. At. <laughs> that's the real conundrum of the day. Dog, that's wild. These are things I think about. I mean, for eleven hundred, yeah, eleven, eleven hundred a week. You think you're Chris? You think you're Chris Brown? You know what I'm saying? Like you, the meet and greets. Is that what he does? No, he charges. He charges him, right? Yeah, like eleven hundred dollars. No shit for the after meet and greets to take those pictures. The but he nerd. does have some ho- like his music is amazing. I can tell y'all don't listen to black news. Duh. <laughs> I listen to I, black I, Twitter because when I said that, y'all was like, "What?" No, I saw the pictures. I scanned it. You scan? Uh, okay. <laughs> Now, yeah, I mean, I saw it. That sounded kind of... How? Look, I mean, not everything I say... The news being it. You no, know what I mean? Like, you no. scared their, their scared news. It. Well, Patrick invented the phrase, let's get dark with it. Let's get dark with it. So, obviously... Stand by it. Yeah. <laughs> stand by it. He Dude, is the, an the, ally. La, the, the last show we were on, because we, we were talking before the show, the last show that we did together, and uh, I went on stage and I asked the audience a question. I was like, is this racist? I, that's how I started my set. Is this racist? Uh, all black people were funny and they could sing. <laughs> it was like... <laughs> <laughs> it's quite a compliment. Uh, right? It's a positive thing. Is it a compliment, though? Or like, is it like a stereotypical... Like, I've seen a lot of movies well, and most of the black people in the movies well, are I, doing I think this. Pat, Pat's not around black people enough, so the only ones he sees are like the famous ones singing. So it's like, <laughs> and my, all of them got it then, obviously. <laughs> in my mind, you're all talented. They're all talented. See? Dog, that is. You just never heard someone that, black like that can't that sing. Wrong? They're they're everywhere. That's a good stereotype. I, you, wouldn't you want that one? Like ours, like we don't like taking I mean, breaks. Look, it's not, that's it's a good stereotype, right? Because it's it's definitely better than like you can't swim, or you can't play quarterback. So it's, <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's definitely good. But like, would you want to be the black person that I feel like? You can sing. All right, now, now it's you know what I'm saying. saying. So now, I was like, okay. Now we're now we're in this situation. You're like, and like here's Patrick, like egging me on, like, hey, come on, sing. Just do that do thing it. you do. Why you think? Why you? Why 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 do you think I can sing? I mean, be, come on, <laughs> come on. Patrick you know, making a beat and shit. <laughs> <laughs> and then before you know, it, you start singing. You're like, oh shit, I can't do this. Mm-hmm. You know, that's wild, know. though. I thought it was a good thing, but the crowd didn't like it. The crowd spoke, and uh, yeah, <laughs> so why I said it on the pod, I have no was idea. Was it racist? I don't think it is. No, but they said the crowd. I think, the- <laughs> I think the crowd was racist. I think they were just like, "Hey, man, not all of them." <laughs> I beg to differ. Yeah, dude, because my friend Damien is not funny. No, but it, it was a <laughs> it was a weird show. Like it was, good, it was a weird show. A so I was just one. like. I was trying to loosen him up because I was going giving the rundown of everybody who was on stage and Quasi was ha- happened to be the last one. I was like, he was a funny one because he, he finally broke the crowd. They're funny. I was like, they're, I think they're all funny and I think they're all, they can all sing, <laughs> right? And so you think like, Kelly's funny? What? <laughs> yeah, but then and then too, right? You think OJ's guy, funny? OJ's means, hilarious. It means like, is that our ultimate superpower so none of us, like, no black celebrity is truly talented? I didn't call you it. You don't say you're, well, you're just oh, black. Well, like, no, shit just nah, got real, real nah, quick. Nah, nah. nah. The way you y'all say have to it? try that much harder. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm I'm not even good. I, I'm just I'm just black. I woke up like this, you know. Yeah, that's it. I don't know, Damn man. Pat. I thought it was a positive thing, but uh, whatever, man. I guess. Uh, <laughs> what? Why, why you think? Why this is why I don't God, compliment nobody. Why God, <laughs> this is why I don't say nice things about nobody, dude. Because they're like, hey, that's kind of. I don't they know. They always get taken out of context. Always take it wrong, man. <laughs> I mean it. I mean it. I mean nothing but the best. <laughs> I'm good hearted with it. Why do you think God loves us that much more than y'all? You know what I'm saying? See, I, would, I didn't say that. that I God, think, I that God it, would but... say, you know who my favorite people are? <laughs> You're going to be funny and you can sing. Yeah. All of you. This is your gift. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cause y'all, Jake, Jake, what is that's your gift? the extra bone in the body? Jake, what is <laughs> he what is got it. what is your gift? You know what I'm saying? Being just uh, always being late, <laughs> <laughs> never asking for a break. That so goes, kind of that goes against the the code of of a, of the culture. I don't see too many. Uh, He's a late Tino. 
All right, fuck it. You didn't was like it, you, it was. It wasn't a good segue. It was like too. It was too quick. Yeah, yeah man. Too, hey, you know, you are, hey. You are. like black people. Yeah. <laughs> Too I quick. That, that uh, was, I'm Speedy uh, Gonzalez with it or something. Uh, uh, you know, you saying never late. No, Speedy right. Gonzalez was never late. Not one episode. Yeah, yeah man. <sighs> Such racially charged. Sometimes it's just early. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, to keep it more racially charged, let me see the notebook. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it. The notebook. <laughs> yeah. Right next to him. Let me see it. Sexy. I All right. So I got you. Uh, Why did I wrote you let down him a bunch of. Read it. Don't. I got it. Don't worry. You don't think they could read? Had he been here on time, he would know what was going on. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this is on you, asshole. Hey, so I know, I know, we all know black men don't cheat. But if you were to bring something, scientific home, fact, Scott. <laughs> hello, you, heard, hello you, heard it, you heard it here first. But like, all right, so if you were gonna take a, like a random girl of the night home, random girl of the night, a girl yeah. of the night. <laughs> That's wild. I can't even think on that level because and, uh, I, don't, I don't do random girls. I have a I have one. I'm a one woman. But before man. that, before that, I love her dearly. Nah, like that's it. Back when you were running and gunning, running and gunning. Yeah, when you were having fun. <laughs> no, Patrick is my spirit animal. I've never cheated. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't cheat. That's well, you're gonna ruin the saying? whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> hypothetically, if you watch the okay. podcast, like we and thought gunning. you did. I'm, you know we we love the hypotheticals. Shoot. Okay, got you. So we're okay, hypothetical. I'm running and gunning. All right, so I got a bunch of rom com. I got some. Ho- I got hoes. <laughs> yeah, you got a roster. I right, bet, bet. Horses in bet. the stable. But you have a hit. You're about to. Okay. So okay. I'm going I'm to name a movie. Okay. What color would that girl be to seal the deal with this movie? Not color per se. Ethnicity. What group <laughs> would she belong to? What, what color? What would she identify as? No, what would you identify hopefully as? She, <laughs> hopefully she her. If you were reporting her to the cops, what would you tell her? <laughs> <laughs> what, what how group? would you describe her? Okay. Yeah. How right, would you ahead. describe her? Are you going to just name movies? Yeah. Okay. But this goes for everyone. Okay. Uh, ten things I hate about you. White. Um, yeah, or or Hispanic, maybe Asian. <laughs> Just gonna name every. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. That you really gotta right whittle there. it down, bro. <laughs> okay. uh, you just yeah. need one. I'll you take need one. It's a yeah. universal movie. Well, look, yeah. it's a it's a it's a universal movie on a certain I, level. Why, who has a day off when I go? <laughs> like who's available? <laughs> and you said and you said I had hoes. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So this is I true. like to you think. have a rolodex, a holodex. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, nothing's really working tonight, dude. <laughs> Late Tito was very good. Late Tito, I want that on the record. Late That's, Tito was Late, good. Late Tito's the episode name. There you go. Not the record show. All right, tell us your head about you. I would think that would be uh, white, uh, Caucasian, pardon, mm-hmm. Caucasian. So that's like, a, is that that's like a Swedish one, too? That's a one culture answer, unless you just say Swedish. Yeah. Well, just, Swedish? just just because ten things I hate about you, I believe it's uh, based off of a Shakespeare play. <laughs> one of them. I yeah, but it was like a don't nineties movie. movie. I remember it was Heath Ledger. I remember it was very popular with white people. So we'll stick with that. Right. And that's why I would pick. Uh, Yo, fifty like, first dates. Yo, um, I think you might could dip into the urban area with that. Black girls love Adam Sandler. Yeah, that they do. Really, I didn't know yeah. that. Well, that seems racist. Because he's like thirty eight percent of his. <laughs> Why? Because he yells a lot. He yells like, like, it's like passive aggressive. I don't know. <laughs> wow, that's your problem. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot the word was revenue. Do you know the you know, of our revenue? Uh, I think the uh, look. The fifty okay. first dates. Have you ever <laughs> have you ever dated Hispanic? Yes. All right. A, a group of them? No. No. <laughs> a group is such a. <laughs> a group is yeah like. Uh, <laughs> a grip is such a, a great you know you bunch measurement you know yeah well we go by bunches you know okay. the way uh-huh. the way it depends on you pick it. Uh, <laughs> a a Patty on fire, dude. Put oh, the gun oh, down. Oh, no, nothing's really Woo, working. Down. I hope you're laughing at home because nobody's <laughs> laughing here. <so. laughs> I, uh, this is great. All right. Uh, oh, wait, wait. So, wait, uh, hold on. Yeah, 51st yeah. dates. Yeah, 51st dates. Uh, y'all are not the first two. Y'all are the first one. Are you, are you, are you, yeah. Uh, 50, the 10 things in about you white, Caucasian. Keith Ledger. Yeah. Okay. And then Everybody Adam agrees? Sandler, black. Black girls love Adam Sandler. Yeah. I stand by that. Uh, Hispanic. Yeah. 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 Everyone who doesn't love Adam Sandler. True that. True That's that. a universe. I say Hispanic because they don't get a lot of. Uh, I mean, he was at the Pearl first dates, you know? Oh, he was a couple months ago. Yeah. Uh, love and basketball. Yo, come on, man. No, hear me out. 
Mine's yeah. a white girl, but like, nah, no. But hear me out. Oh, is it a like, white girl with cornrows? Yes, yeah. And yeah, she's got like, she has she's a lot got of black like friends. A, she's, <laughs> got <laughs> like a, she's got like a like a hood name, like Courtney. It's that's like, not hood. That's, not a, that's hood a hood name. name. <laughs> Courtney. Yes. Like know. Kayla is kind of like hood. Now you know some white girls named Chris, Kayla. I know, I know some white. Yeah, so Yankee, that's kind of like hood. But is her having cornrows is too. Courtney is black or fat white woman. I've never seen a, a, a black. No, I know. I mean, like, look. Courtney. Let me put this out there. My my first Kardashian. woman I had first. My first child with her name is Courtney. Oh shit! So it's, just, it's a black <laughs> name, and I know a couple of Courtneys that are black. What'd Definitely. you say about the name? Hard Courtney? black name. Uh, <laughs> Did you feel like with a dick the though? Yeah, <laughs> both. What? Uh, I know. Oh, two separate ones. I know, C's, <laughs> I know C's, the mother of my children. She's a K. I was thinking yeah. when you said when you said her name was she's Courtney with the C R K. Both? I thought she put both of them in her name. Dog. It was KC Ortney. <laughs> Nothing? Okay. Fuck, dude. Patrick might be racist. You, know what I'm <laughs> you think she's a gang member? Like she's, she put CK in there? There's an apostrophe for so sure. Courtney, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> what was this? That's the name of this episode. La- Courtney? Latino. Latino. Sha Courtney. Uh. Oh man! Everybody See, this one I thought was obvious black. That was See, uh, I, I think mine was loving basketball. Yeah, you, no, yeah, go yeah, back because that, that's uh, like it's, it's kind of like a dead giveaway. But that's like a save the last. I also dance. feel like you could do you could do Mexican with that too. I don't know. You could do ghetto white chicks, especially <sighs> back then. Look, I feel like back, I mean they were like back then they, they dressed like it, but they weren't. But they dressed ghetto like white cool chicks is more hustle and flow. Yes. Oh yes. Oh, not now really I a rom com. That it, it is. It's a story. Every movie's of, a rom com. Then, if you think about it, especially if somebody falls in love, did he? He fell in love with his main hoe. I thought he fell in love with music. That's still love. True love. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I was. I'll save this one. No, oh, I forget the last one. Wedding singer. Dog. <laughs> Dog, go uh, well, to. There's, there's, that there's was my go to. Fucking, that was my go to. Now the fucking cat's out the bag. So. <laughs> yeah. Now the cat's out the bag. That was my go to when I was young, man. And I was like ripping and running. Is that what you said? Yeah, running and gunning. I was, I was running and gunning. Yeah. And yeah, I could put the wedding singer on for any genre. And any genre? Up. Genre. <laughs> any genre that would come over. Yeah. Uh, yeah, was, yeah, was, yeah. Definitely, definitely goes back to Jacob. Always a hit with black women. They love Sandler. The Wedding Singer was a great rom com because it was about marriage and heartbreak and shit like that. So it's like it, it takes you up and down. You know what I'm saying? And by and by the time you probably get to a certain part of the movie, y'all already are like you know really affectionate. Like you know at least you should be. So you've only seen the first thirty minutes of it? No, like I've seen it. I've seen it forty the whole thing. times. Because once I, you know, I don't know if it's any young players watching, but you know, grab grab a pen and paper. So once you get to a certain level of of affection, you in control. Now you got to make her wait. Damn. You don't just take off on the couch. You make her wait. So I watched the whole movie. Hey, we going to finish this. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we going to finish this. Stop, <laughs> stop trying to put my penis in your mouth. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. We're gonna. This is the. At least wait till they're on the plane. Wait yeah. till they're on the plane. This movie's Billy climax. Idol's coming out. <laughs> <laughs> this movie's climax is important than ours, right? You gotta watch it. You gotta see Billy Idol. Just with yeah. just with Patrick. Billy said. Idol gets it. Yeah, yeah. I would say Asian. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 was, I was gonna try to do a joke because I was thinking about this. Uh, I've never really dated outside of my race too much. My ethnicity, whatever. <laughs> did a couple of whites. That's your ethnicity, I thought. I did a, a, a oh, no, that's Korean. <gasps> uh, I'm not sure which north or south, but her parents, <laughs> her parents owned a dry cleaner, so I don't know what that means. Mm. Dad. I think that's just universal for both of them. Uh, yeah, well, then that tells that's like me both nothing. sides. Because well, it's I ownership. Know. Yeah. Very sneaky. Yeah. Ver. But isn't that, I've. But, uh, 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 I've only enjoyed sex with my own ethnicity. That's really? Wild. So you've had sex with other ethnicities? Well, uh, why? But you didn't enjoy <laughs> cool. it? Well, I mean, it was just it was just weird. It wasn't like it didn't. Feel, <laughs> I don't know. 
It's just like more comfortable with my own people. I don't fuck oh, this sounds yeah. right. Uh, <laughs> get it out, son. Get it, get it out. out. This is it's gonna be the last episode. Oh, you know what I'm saying? So, I really need to think about is, this. Things I this saying. is the last one. So fire before. from the hip. Yeah. Let it go. Uh, but uh, 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 they're shutting y'all down after this. So get, <laughs> say what you gotta say. What you gotta say now. Just I don't know. Out. I mean, I, I'm all like, if you want to be biracial or whatever, but I, like, it's <laughs> just, <laughs> just not me and mine. <laughs> if you want to fuck up your gene pool? Do that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, dude. I don't care what you do. Yeah, it's not my family. It's yours. No, so. You know, you got cute kids, whatever. But yeah. like, I'm just saying, like, I don't. I really uh, enjoyed like the, the being with my my own kind, my own. I don't know shit. It's, it's just. You got, I, you, would I, you, I, <laughs> Would you marry somebody who wasn't black? Marry? That's why you have to put that. Like, cool, okay, would you, yeah, would you? Yeah, because yeah, that's the like, biggest. No, I, I, let, let me say this: if I if I fell in love with someone who wasn't wasn't black, then yeah, yeah, if that was the case, I don't feel like I, I don't. I'm not in a place mentally where I'll say oh, I will only marry a black woman. Because, but I do understand what you're saying about dating your kind. Because I haven't. <laughs> Damn, right. sounds, that sounds when worse. You, we're back. <laughs> we're back. <laughs> that sounds worse. Uh, I'm not saying your ethnicity because I primarily dated my ethnicity, ethnicity, and that's where I feel most comfortable. You know, so I, I, I get it. Uh, but yeah. would you marry someone that wasn't Hispanic? Latino? I don't. I don't think so. I, like I said, I've, I've dated think a, you couple, do it? a couple white people. No, I don't think so. I mean, I've, is it the food? Uh, it's probably the food. <laughs> Like you don't want raisins? No, it's, it's, it's probably the food. Casserole? It's casserole. <laughs> it's the food, the culture, and it's just you like, gonna be cussing know. at every meal. Why are you trying to fry everything, bitch? <laughs> nah, man. All my meals are. are you know what trans fats <laughs> is, bitch? <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't matter if my wife's making spaghetti; it's still Mexican food, you know. <laughs> Uh, I don't know, I, man. I just thought. I why thought are these was... noodles so long, bitch? This supposed to be for day. This was. I don't know, man. I just thought that was an interesting thing. Like the, my most enjoyable experiences have been with. <laughs> <laughs> what? It's, it's just a... your wording. It's a... <laughs> and then you realize what you're saying, and you're like, "Oh After shit, the... let me defend myself." No, it's just it's y'all's reaction that makes it bad. <laughs> if I was here talking to myself, I would have no problem. Oh, of course, I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, know yeah. that. No <laughs> makes sense. You know what I'm saying? But I'm the complete opposite, man. I've dated like a lot of races, and I've enjoyed everyone outside of my race more. <laughs> Okay, interesting. So outside of your race, yeah, right. So okay. Jacob hates his own. So kind. you, so you can tell there's a Put difference. That on there. Yeah, of course. There's All a right. difference. There differences difference. are good. I like differences. You know, they are good. Do you, <laughs> do you feel, do you like, feel like there's more differences, like sexually, or just more difference in lifestyle? Like how? Uh, <clears throat> both, I guess. Um, day to day life. This one time, I did uh, was dating this like Indian girl. Oh, that's right. And uh, as soon as I got there, she made me take off my boots. I said no. And she your was, feet stink? Yeah. Okay. And like I'm like, because it's that. Also, like she's like, hey, you have to take off your boots. Like I was like, I'm not gonna take off my boots. And she's like, well, it's a land, it's my landlord's rule. And I was like, well, I'm gonna leave. Like Damn. I left. Like I refused to take off my shoes because I had stinky feet, and I like just left. And she was like shocked by that. You was and, like Costanza's dad. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, I was thinking yeah, like Donnie Brasco. I mean, no. <laughs> I mean, okay, maybe I probably shouldn't say this. That's an Indian. But if you were. If I were to say it, what I, maybe someone else might think, if they heard that story, they might would think culturally, who's to say the smell would be offensive? Oh, <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh, my <laughs> God, dude. Wow, <laughs> banger! <laughs> Guy's got a point. Guy's got a point. And I oh, say man. that it's I just didn't... contagious. We're just no, all saying the wrong no, shit dude. today. Dude. <laughs> admiration was awesome. for the Indian people <laughs> culture. I love those people. Yeah, I don't know why, uh, but she lived in a. <laughs> That's one of them right there. Like, a... hey, what's that? <laughs> you got someone trying to break into Stop Scott's that apartment. <laughs> <laughs> His doors are unlocked, by the way. 24-7. Uh, his address is... They're not even going to wait till after the show, huh? No. It's, cool. oh, it's just going to I bet you we get big then. Mm. Views go up. 
But yeah, I, so like the whole Indian thing was cool, but she lived in a house with nothing but white people. Like she didn't live at, this wasn't like her parents' home. She okay. was like, had roommates and shit. And that was like their rule. I was like, no. I left. Oh, but you thought it was cultural thing because it was her? Yes. But it was just, hey, it's, it's, no, a, it's a, a fucking new rug, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Take yeah. your fucking boots off. Yeah. Plot yeah, twist, Jacob's racist. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm an adult. I'm not going to take off my shoes when someone I think asks. I think the deeper story here is you don't respect people's boundaries. No, but look. Today they don't stink. No. We hope. They're fine. I mean, I would have said something if they you did. Because I'm that friend. It was just like the, the said, audacity to be like. It didn't stink until Jacob came in here and took his shoes off. Take your shoes And then off. I wouldn't say Jacob's feet stink, but I would just point to like, hey, until this happened, yeah. there wasn't a problem. It didn't smell in here before. Now it does. <laughs> There'd be a come a point in time where I'd take them off, you know, yeah. when we're doing the whole hey ho, you know, and then I'd put them back on. But, you know. You oh, know. you're not fucking with your boots on? No. You never fuck with your boots on? Sometimes, maybe. Once. But are your what pants, was his name? Are your pants still on, though? Like your uh, pants just pulled You know down? what? I do love a good old, like, let's just get this on really quick, fully clothed type of thing. Like, really? a, little naughty, like a little naughty, like, hey, just pull them down a little bit. No. I'll pull mine down a little bit. It's no. fun. It's exciting. No. Shirt, too? I've done that in public. Yeah, sometimes. Like a big person? <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. The shirt on is kind of hot sometimes. Like, I like a little bit of clothing. I like, mm -mm. I like to put my shit through the hole like that. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm in my 40s, so you know I'm sweating. You know what I'm saying? I need, I need to ventilate this bitch. Oh my God. <laughs> I need, I need, matter of fact, cut the fan on. <laughs> you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, dude. Yeah, I don't know. It's like the, in, like the Indian, she's still cool. Uh, <laughs> I dated like an Asian chick. Very, very fun. Very fun. She was like the freakiest, even though like she was like very mild mannered, like in public, but she was like, a freak behind the scenes, you know what I mean? So, I don't know. White girls are typically boring to me. Like, Damn. <laughs> I'm yeah. gonna say, like, white girls are like pretty usually boring to me. And then, like, I enjoy the the colors, like the blacks That's and the browns. That you the blacks and the that. browns. I like, you know, the colors. Okay. Like, you just gonna put them together too? <laughs> God. <damn> it. <laughs> POC. And then <laughs> he enjoys the POC. <laughs> I love me a POC. And then we're going to go to the crayon box. Over here. <laughs> <laughs> this is my favorite right here. That's wild. He, right. he loves the SEX with the POC. You know? <laughs> Prefer. All right, it. Scott, what's well, your it turn is to. People for him. It's your turn to cancel yourself, Scott. So go ahead. Speak. Uh, love is love, man. That's it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> are you, um, are you love coming wins, out, bro? Dog, dog, love, man. Love wins. Love that's love. it. Yeah, yeah. That's it. You know. You did kiss me recently. I did. Yeah. For a while. Let's talk that's about that. Longer than that's wild. Okay. <laughs> I was talking them down like real proper. You know what's crazy is, <laughs> and it wasn't it, even for content. They just, just did it for just nothing. Just did it. Just, yeah. Was it drugs? Was it go viral or were they, so, were they sober? Oh, I wasn't there. Yeah. That then was, we were. Yeah. Okay. I, well, he so was it doing wasn't, the, It wasn't even like, you know, like <clears throat> in or in the ambitions. It was just like raw. Like. <laughs> I post, I think you uh, saw it. I posted on my stories. I, I was a couple of beers deep. I was, And I was the kissy. He was the kisser. He was, he was a couple yeah. of beers deep. He was deep. trying to take advantage of okay. it, I think. Aren't no, we were chilling here. You were a couple of beers deep, deep so though, you was right? down. <laughs> that's wild that you would say that. Uh, <laughs> Not if it's true, dude. That's that's hey, look. That's another thing. Sometimes oh, facts are hurtful, but they are facts. Dog, now that's the word we can't say, bro. He said facts. <laughs> facts. No, I know he facts. said facts. Big but facts. But it did facts. sound like the. the it didn't did sound questionable. It, sound like the it doesn't even thing. make sense in the sentence. It, it makes does. sense. It makes sense if you want it to make sense, Quasi. <laughs> it makes sense if you want it to make sense. Big big facts. <laughs> I guess let me let me think about it. Okay, I guess oh. they can be hurt. But look, that's wild. <laughs> that's wild. The child would even take that. Hey man, I mean, it's just these. I don't know. Our, our ears are like just tuned in for that. The words like no. That. Look that that word is like dog. Big facts. Dog, <laughs> dog, dog. If I if I hear someone use it like loosely, like gaming. I'm like, oh, you're one of those people. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, you, you might be a school shooter. I think if you. No, I'd be him, afraid to fight that one, for <clears> sure. <throat> no, no, that's a, that's a, that's a, a level of like angst. Yeah. Using, using that. When you hear it in when, the wild, it's great. When you, 
when it's used with what? in the wild, when you hear it in the wild, like yeah, yeah when you're unexpectedly, when someone else says it, you're like, oh shit, I you're remember like, that. <laughs> no, not even that. Like, because I because I come from that time, right? Yeah, you know when it was acceptable. I still, when it, but still like even even, even when they it. even any usage of that, I give you like the cartoon eye, like yeah, no, yeah. yeah. I am the same. You way. is wild, dog. Like you gonna really say that? And the, don't like, look how you said in the wild. If I hear you using it in the wild, like in public, I'm like, oh, you don't care about nothing. You yeah, must, no, you the, must got a gun on you. In, like, <laughs> like, if you're at Walmart in the produce section hey, and you know the f bomb, in like, the wild, yo, Tom. Oh, <laughs> like, oh. I remember that. <laughs> yeah, it makes me happy. Yeah, if you had like, customer oh. service in Target, you know, what yeah, because like, yeah. they won't take your return without a receipt, and you drop an f bomb. I'm like, dog, that is crazy. No, he was talking about in in the wild, the gay bar. Is that the name of the place? I, don't know. I thought it was the Bono. <laughs> I was just making it up. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I was holding on to that. Pat and then I got it out. Pat and I was like, this new material. Was it, was it, oh, the mic was canceled today. So I'm just like, <laughs> yeah, none, of this, um, none of this shit. new material, dog. No, it's not working. Don't keep any of this. Hey, but the, the good thing is, at least I got it out. I got it out. Yeah. And now I know. Late Tino was still very good. Late Tino was good. That was a heater. Very good. That, that was, was a heater. Good. Um, I thought that was mine. I didn't say that, or he said that. Uh oh. Oh, I don't know. Are you stealing credit. from? Not need my credit. Are you still in the music? This is like Elvis, like Elvis need, Presley situation. Yeah, yeah, not need my reparations, dog. Hey, uh, good thing it's recorded, man. We'll find out. <laughs> we'll find out. On? I don't know if we got that on tape, man. Got it. Hey, but just so you know, whatever you say, whatever you say on here, I can use. I got you. Okay. I don't. I don't recall signing no disclaimer, Mister Beast. Oh damn it! We have the old one. We have the old one. Do we ever have a release? I thought the old one. The old. We had everybody sign the, the board. In the office? Oh, the board. Yeah, yeah, or yeah. you threw it away. No, I still have it. And I'm sure you're on there, bro. I'm sure I'm not. No, nah, because you did it over it's there. It's called Loopholes. <laughs> <laughs> I think I signed someone else's name. Oh, that's smart. Show, 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 show Jacob that set list. That I had, I had some questions that I wanted to ask. Because I like to be prepared. <laughs> What's the first one? Say? So those are quasi questions that he quasi <laughs> brought to the pod. That's good. That's I like another. to be. I'm gonna take a picture of it and, and connect it with y'all later on your on your uh, on your social media platforms. The like platforms. a mature adult. <laughs> My last one I didn't put on there. I had to you know make sure that uh, Patrick was okay with it. No, oh, I don't remember that. You don't remember me? Yeah. What was the last one? It was uh, Patrick's dad. Cause he, oh, because yeah. he's a bitch ass nigga. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can say that. Yeah. My thoughts exactly. <laughs> Other people's mom and your dad, because he's a bitch ass nigga. <laughs> dude. Dude, you should let Patty say that on stage. <clears throat> no, I would never. <laughs> let it out once. The, what, the one time I knew that I was comfortable with, with Plowsy, remember that? Remember that night at uh, Jokesters? It sounds pretty weird when you say it like that. Remember that? <laughs> Remember that? You remember that? You remember when I got really comfortable with you? Pat and replays I was like, it every night in his brain. I was like, hey, Duh. I think we're friends now. Uh, he was walking around jokesters uh, with the what truly, right? And you're like, I can't be walking around this thing. I, I feel like, uh, what did you say? Faxed. What, Faxed. What, 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 what was the word I used? A B-A-N? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, bitch ass nigga. And I was like, quasi, I was just thinking the same thing about you. <laughs> And he laughed his ass off. Universal like, feeling, dog. Yeah, we had. They was giving them away. I think it was like a like a sponsorship. Like, yeah, but like just so walk they was passing them out. Yeah, because this was before. Like it became like a big thing for yeah. a dude to walk around with a slim can. And now, I, you know, whatever. You said a slim can. <laughs> there were slim cans. Pause. There were slim cans. Well, I think I sometimes really. it's just about the beverage. Like it's a soft ass. You know, drink. like what I mean, you could have put it in a glass. If it's you, a soft ass. That's drink. even softer. Really? Like, yeah. Because yeah. if you put that in a glass, it should only be like got, then you got to sit with your legs crossed like this. Not it should be like in a beer, like a beer color. Then it should be in a plastic cup, like you had a plastic kickback cup. Yeah. and it could get shot plastic up. Plastic any red solos. Moment. Yeah, preferably blue. That's not red <laughs> solo material. Not red solo. Why not, not red solo? <clears throat> red solo is for hard shit. Like, look, for let, the me function, just, let me tell y'all the story before we run out of time. <laughs> You got somewhere to go. You, you wanted, it, you wanted you the story. Off, bro? No, I did. I did. I did. I'm yeah. saying he wanted the story. I don't know what the time constraints are. No, we're I just, good. Yeah, let me let me get it we out. Still have this, two this hours. Is, this, oh, do we? No. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching any of them. And uh, we it's a, it's a red solo moment too. I was at this uh, after hours. It was probably was like I, I think I can date it and be cool. Probably was like 98, 99, right? I was working at this call center. Hella cool. 
I was early twenties, probably like um, twenty one. No, right over here off of uh Exchange Parkway. Okay, okay, okay. I'll say that. It used to be trees. If it, yeah. It, <laughs> <laughs> There's a, Wal- there's a Walmart there right now. You know what I'm that Walmart wasn't even there, Jake. When I, when I was going to work every day, it wasn't even there. Uh, so Popeye's there now. Popeye's wasn't even, Popeye wasn't there when I was in school. So, yeah. <laughs> Bazinga. All right. Yeah. So, that's what. That's my open mic moment, Pat, right there. Nah, you know what I'm saying? Like, I like that it. was like what three laughs? <laughs> that was like three laughs. That was like three laughs per minute too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was high, dog. Y'all see? Yeah. That shit was high. All right, yeah. So look. <laughs> so look, it's it's a it's like a it's a, it's a Friday, right? It's after it's after work. I don't drink like that. Never been like a, a a drinker to the point where like I'm drinking consistently, throwing drinks back, throwing shots back. Drinking like that. I'm going to pull up at some point. Mm-hmm. You know, when I say some point, I mean like two drinks in. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Maybe three. You catch me with four. You're like, damn, he, he's hurting. You really? know what I'm saying? Like, he, either he's either he's <laughs> dealing with some shit or he's trying to fuck. You know what I'm saying? He already got <laughs> something lined up. He, he finna go do some shit. So, I, so I'm hanging out with, you know, like adult adults. And some like people in my in their 20s, but like, you know, people in their 30s. And so they got all these drinks at, at the spot. Uh, in somebody's apartment. And I'm kind of in a love triangle at this time. <laughs> the love triangle is going to come into play later on. In the <laughs> so one of the girls in the love triangle, she worked with me. She had the kickback. My, my girl, air quotes, uh, she was like, you know, she didn't want to go. She was going to stay in my apartment. She mm-hmm. was just, you know, when I got done, she would be there. All right, cool. So I'm there, but I'm there unsupervised. <laughs> like, I don't have any of my friends with me. Uh-huh. I'm there solo and people I work with. And I think as people who do comedy, you know if you're a natural comic. You know, most people like you. People you work, they, they like being yeah. around you for the most part. You mm-hmm. funny. This, this is who I am for the most part. Mm-hmm. So... While we're there drinking, I'm drinking kind of like what they drinking. You know, try this, try that. I don't have any kind of like gauge mm. to say, all right, dude, like, I don't drink this or I don't drink that. So I'm getting fucked up kind of fast. Mm-hmm. Blend it in. In steps this B A N. Bitch ass nigga named Fireball. You know what I'm saying? Fire. <laughs> dog. You know what I'm saying? Dog. I took maybe like two shots. And that's when shit got like mm. a fucking like you know how those cutaway movies be like it's mm. <laughs> <laughs> what's going on yeah I don't know what was going on like I think I was on a zebra you know what I'm saying like <laughs> 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 we was playing bacon I don't I don't remember right mm. what I do remember <laughs> is I was so fucked up I couldn't drive yeah so my love triangle person she took me back oh, to her house oh. Yeah, she took me back to her house. And then I feel like it was consensual. But <laughs> yeah, I don't want to say I don't want to I don't want to make her out to be the bad guy. Uh, okay. but, all right, all right, all right, all right. You know, but she had her way with you, brother. <laughs> for a while. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> all right, so this is probably like three o'clock in the morning, four o'clock in the morning. And then after, I do remember like us being fin- finishing, and I was like, I need to, you know, rest. I need to rest. <laughs> <laughs> I need to rest. Like I'm fucked up, you know what I'm saying? Like I, <laughs> it's like a lot going on, you know? Like so, so I, I've been fucked up. Yeah, I, I, just, I just had to perform, you know what I'm saying? Uh, all my basketball enthusiasts. If you remember Jordan in the flu game, you know what I'm saying? Like I, I had to rise to the occasion. I was under the You got to get carried off the court. Yeah, I was done. You know what I'm saying? I was done. Done. It was weak in the knees. Done, son. But I put up 63, though. You know what I'm saying? I got us, I got us where we needed to be. You know, so I, 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 I go to sleep. I wake up. It's probably like four phone is like look like a christmas tree lighting up sh- sh- lighting up lighting up and uh this is like the new era of cell phones so you know like 
like not new era, but like you know, we coming into like the prime codes and like the the star tax and all that shit, right? My shit is on fire. You know what I'm saying? Just fire. Like the phone's ringing, and um, dog. So I'm looking at the phone. It's my it's my girl calling. You know, I'm like, damn. You know, it's like four. I'm like, I'm getting ready. You know, I'm like, now nah, I should just leave. She calling the phone. You know, like back to back, back to back, back to back, back to back. I can remember one time she stopped calling for a minute and I looked at the phone, <laughs> like to look at it. Like, it and broken? it was like 57 missed calls. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I was like, damn. You know, like, so, okay. Fuck, cool. I'm in trouble. <laughs> yeah. Dog. I said, look, man, I had to tell old girl. And, um, you know, as a man, I'm willing to say this on camera. It broke my heart to tell her I need you to lie for me. You know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> I really care about her. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I did. I do. I did. You know what I'm saying? Like, in, in a regard, it was just, I was in a certain place. Um, I was fighting some demons. And I, <laughs> <laughs> I was just a young man. You're you know, four like, drinks in. You're hurting. Uh, you're, 20, you're, 20, <laughs> you're in your 20s? I was in my 20s, early 20s. Uh, yeah, you know. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was, in a, I was in a certain place emotionally. Oh, so, uh, yeah, I was like, I'm no good for you. But, uh, you know, I'm good for you, but I'm not good for you. <laughs> so I had to ask her to lie for me on some. Hey, tell her that I'm here. But you took me here because I was so fucked up. I couldn't drive. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And you just took me to your house. All right, cool. She and was cool with it? Yeah, she did. But but, <laughs> I could see the pain in her eye, Patrick. Oh, oh, no. It was like, it was almost like I asked her to get an A word. Mm. And she wanted to have a family. <laughs> <laughs> And it's like no, That's so deep. There. <laughs> it's like, it was almost like that type of vibe. You know what I'm saying? Like I can see the pain in your eyes. <laughs> oh my god! And then in my head, Quasi like flips his coat back. It's like whistles as he's leaving. Yeah. <laughs> See you later. You know what I'm saying? I put my hat to the back. But that's a that's a ride or die situation though. She was she was there. Nah, she was solid, solid, she solid. solid. So, uh, I won't. Because of the story, they and don't stuff make it like, like that. that no more, I man. definitely won't name names and be like this person. Da, da, da. And you know what? But it's solid, solid. You'll never hear me complaining about women because I've always dealt with solid good women. It's always me yeah. and the shit I was doing. You know, so sometimes shit I, I should have been doing and wasn't doing. Amen. You know what I'm saying? Good, 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 solid woman. She did the the lie, right? She did the lie. So when I got there, you know, like when I got in the car, I called. You know, you know, she going out crying. Da, 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 da. You know, wow, where you been? I can't believe you did this. I'm like, man, you know, I'm so <clears throat> up. I didn't, you know, I don't drink like that. Da, da, da. And she was like, well, and this was like the the hole in the story, where she was like, well, she took if she took you home, why she didn't bring you here? Mm. She know where you live at. You know what I'm saying? Like she know where your apartment is, and her house is past your house mm. you know what I'm saying I lived off of like San Pedro you thought you were really like clear dude. and 410 she lived off of like over there like 1604 in Boverde old yeah. Scott old Scott would have been like she was fucked up too and she didn't want to drive by herself <laughs> <laughs> so y'all both fucked up driving a car yeah whatever you know what's so funny too? Like as I don't we were let telling, no girls crash at my crib except for you, girl. That's right. That's Get them. Right. Come yeah. on, Scott. Wow. Come on, Scott. I feel like I raised you right, boy. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Dude. Yeah. Under pressure. Good one. It's four, probably like it's definitely four quarter. It's twenty years too late. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But I appreciate <laughs> I appreciate that died. gym right there. You know what's so funny? While you were telling that story, your phone went off like five times. That's her. <laughs> I'm serious. So you're back to your same tricks. You might, uh, <laughs> you might want to check so fast it. forward, we married. and uh, uh, No way, really? No, we're not. Uh, like, you know how no awesome that would have been? I was like, that would have been cool, right? I got to fucking erase this whole thing. Now. <laughs> walk off. That would have been cool, right? Dude, I, so that's my girl. You know what I'm saying? Well, she took me back after that. Yeah. And, uh, Statue of limitation. Yeah. You know, you can't, wow. can't get mad at me now. Yeah, yeah, she <laughs> she when, they're, when they're down for you, they're down for you, man. I remember I had this this girl lie for me one time. Uh, shout out him and Bria. <laughs> 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 this is like a couple of years ago. It was a love triangle situation, too. This is where I fucked up. <clears throat> we went to karaoke Dog. together. She was using a fake name. Girl A, which is Ambria, and girl B didn't know her real name. So where she fucked up was to go sign up for karaoke, she wrote her real name. And like that's how the other girl found out. You know what I mean? So that's how I got did in. Like 
because she knew about her, but she didn't know that that was her. You think she signed up on purpose? Oh, uh, look, I can trump that story. <laughs> <laughs> like all some other shit, man. One time I I had like an incident where I was cheating and I had this girl like come over like on some quick shit. And um, she was kind of like, she was thick, right? So when she was putting her clothes on, she only had like the the old school car key that was just like two keys, you know, one to get in, yeah. one to you know start the car. So it was like, um, that's probably her calling me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, so look, she so like after you know she puts her clothes on, she can't find the car key. She's looking for everywhere. She can't find the car key. We looking in the car. You know what I'm saying? We're trying to figure it out. My girl is like, okay, I'm done with what I've been doing. I'm about to head to the apartment. I'm like, all right, cool. You're Ferris Bueller, dog. Damn, dude. Let me tell you how I did it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, girl knew I had a girl, so it wasn't like I had to yeah. finesse. I was like, what we're going to do is we're going to put it on my brother and Suge. They was over here. Y'all was over here with them. You lost your key. They left. They coming back. All right, cool. So, but I, again, I could see the hurt in her eyes when oh. my girl came. Oh. And, you know, I hugged hey. her. Yeah, hey, babe. You don't send that up. She's speaking to her. How y'all doing? Da, da, da. Man, you could go wait in the back. You good. Go get in the bed. You straight. You know what I'm saying? I had already, like, you know, swapped the, the stuff out on the bed. Yeah. So, we was good on that. And uh, I was like, man. Pro move. You know where the key was, dog? Because she was kind of thick, right? The key was in the little small pocket. Oh. And when she was patting in the pocket, she couldn't feel it. Oh, uh, that's not thick. She was fat. No, she wasn't fat. Bro. <laughs> I know. I know the difference, okay? I know the difference. To not right? feel keys in the pocket? Well, the, the pants was tight. <laughs> <laughs> because she was fat. <laughs> <laughs> See, Patrick gets it. <laughs> Patrick is a genius. You know what I'm saying? He's a genius. He's a genius. <laughs> That's wild, man. Like, I don't have any stories like that. Yeah. <laughs> no, I've man. never cheated. No, no, my early 20s, like, dog, I got, Black I United. got, I, I used to do the most.com. Even before I was in my 20s, I first started driving. I was driving as a teenager. I had one time, I had a girlfriend, and um, she was in the house. Like, we lived in Dover, mm. and my girlfriend was in the house. Like, you know, she was, she had, she had got dropped off because I think I was like 17. My girlfriend was like 16. So, we, I'm still going to school. Um, she in the house. This other girl that went to a different school from me, uh, she pulled up while I was outside working. I had just bought this cash car, this Cadillac. It was like an 82 Coupe de Ville. I was outside uh, fucking with it, me and my dad. So I caught her as she pulled up. And so, you know, when I seen her pull up, she was like, yeah, I was in the neighborhood. I, you know, I was calling your, I was calling the phone. I had a phone upstairs. Yeah. Landline. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, uh, you know, you could tell I was rich. Mm. I had a landline. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I had a landline, and um, man, she was calling the phone. I wasn't answering because I was, you know, yeah, well, outside. outside. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, the, and, my, and my girl, she, she was like in the living room, so she wasn't upstairs to hear the phone. So there was like a good thing, so she didn't fuck with the phone. So, she, you know, she pulled up. She was like, what you doing? You know, she had a homegirl with her. I was like, oh, man, me and my dad out here working on the car. She, da, 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 we was going to come kick it with you. I was like, give me a minute, man. You know, because me and my dad work on the car. We got to go to the thing and get some more shit. And, you know, I get up with you in a minute. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 All right, cool. All right, got cool. You know, oh, well, you know, I'm going to go back around the corner to her house. All right, I'm going to call you. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to call you. Shit. <laughs> Boy, once we got fenced with that car, hey, well, you, you ready to go? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> you ready to get on up out of here? Yeah. yeah I'll uh, call you. But yeah. don't you ever, ever, ever. <laughs> I'd, have, I'd have some moments, man. <laughs> That's wild, dude. Mm -hmm. I've never been able to do like just that right there. I've never been able to do it. Yo, you ready to go now? Yeah. Because that's like the most, uh, yo, get the fuck out. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Now, I, I would like, because it's different if it's just, if it's no sex involved. I don't feel like I'm being rude if there's no sex involved. Interesting. Now, if, it's, if, if I just hit, and you know, we just did what we do, yeah. I ain't going to be rude and say, hey, you Get know, out. <laughs> I ain't going to do that. I ain't going to do that. Yeah. Should we, uh, should I'm we gonna call? I'm going to say, what I'm going to say is, you hey, what her? you about to do? Tell yeah. story. <laughs> I'm going to ask that question. What you about to do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's Well, solid. yeah, what you yeah, about that's to do? All right, I'm, I'm not going to shower. Because the shit. other question is rude. Yeah, yeah. This uh, this was uh, is cordially saying, hey, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's forget the fuck. We done. Out. You know what yeah. I'm saying? We done here. Yeah. Uh, what's the other one? Um, so what else you got playing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's so, a real one. I, I think I had that one. Yeah. So what else you got going on today? What you gonna do today? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was fun. 
My fault. Yeah, other than me. Jackie you wants to call his girl. Why? Old girl about the cheating story. Do you because you want to call his that girl? Was a good, do you think it's a good idea? Should we call her really quick? I don't know. Do you think it's and a good ask, idea? And yeah. ask her like what's the what was the stupidest cheating story? Or if she remembers that story. Call your girl or my girl? Old girl. No, no, no. The one that was trying to hook, hook <laughs> yeah. him up. Not about call. Yeah, old you girl. See my, you see how my energy got different? Like, yeah. <laughs> how the fuck you know this? Don't know my girl. What kind of podcast is this, goddammit? <laughs> and I call this shit over, Jacob. Call your girl and ask her? Yeah. What are we asking her? About that cheating story, that if she remembers, remembers it. it. That the time you got caught cheating? Yeah, the, at karaoke. the karaoke bar. That's <laughs> why. Okay. Yeah. That was insane. Uh, Symbatico. Hey, baby. Hey. Oh, shit. <laughs> hey, by the way, you're live on the podcast. <laughs> by yeah. the way. That's and, a, that's uh, a, that's <laughs> that shit is, that shit is about to get different as fuck because she got such positive energy. <laughs> Pat, Just hang up, that. dog. Hang Pat, up. that. Do you remember that time uh, we went to karaoke and the love triangle situation was, uh, I got caught? Yeah, I'm Bria and Mia. <laughs> <laughs> can, you uh, recall, can you recall that story really quick? Or what was the stupidest like cheating story you remember about me? No, that, it was that night. I just remember, okay, so we went in that night and you were like, I don't really want to introduce you to my comedy friends, so we're going to call middle name. And I was just, I'm dumb. I'm going along with it. I'm like, all right, cool. You can call me that. So I'm going around introducing myself to everybody as charisma. And that's what? Dumb. <laughs> charisma. Dumb. 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 Is that a stripper? <laughs> that's her middle name. So you're not even letting name. this girl use her real name? And then um, she comes out of nowhere, like near the end of the night. And you don't tell me anything about this girl. So I'm thinking she's just another comedy friend and we're all just hanging out. But secretly, she's your other girlfriend. <laughs> Dog, you wild. You bold and, as shit. Um, <laughs> and, Talking about my guys, comedy you friends. Funny. <laughs> and when we get to the karaoke bar, I don't remember. She sings some song. And then I think I realized that like something is going on because y'all walk outside together. And then I was about to sing a song. And then I got sad. So I was like, no, I just canceled my song when I got on the stage. <laughs> and then you went up there and started singing Mostly Dawn. <laughs> no, wait, wait, wait. No. <laughs> no, wait, time out, time out. Oh, I, did not oh, sing that. I did not sing that song. Hold Trump on. Trump punk, I ain't never been a punk. I don't even know that song. <laughs> That's why they have the lyrics. Okay. Like, Shake it. <laughs> That's why they have the lyrics. That's why they have the lyrics up there, Jacob. Okay. Right. I'll, I'll send you a waiver form. Uh, thank you. This was fun. I'll call you back. Okay. Thank uh, you, Charisma. Thank you. Bye. Dog, that's wild. That was interesting. It started off charisma. Yo, how did she start that conversation? Dog, her that energy was, was so good minutes. when you picked when she picked up the phone. Hey, bitch. Hey, baby. I was like, oh, you yeah, finna fuck you that. that. I haven't talked to her in a minute. You are t- you are a terrible oh. person. Dog. Hey, baby. And that's how you start after months of talking. <laughs> hey, listen. I'm like, bitch, is this number you? Who hey, is babe. It? She was down. She was down. She was. That was a true love at one point in time. Fucking charisma, dog. That is wild. That's her middle name, though. Her real name I is I do charisma. apologize for that. You're not a no. stripper. No. That's her real name? Her, they, yeah, her, her real middle name. We're saying a lot of names on this. That's wild, dog. I'm not editing shit. Look, dude. the fact... <laughs> yeah, dog, that was wild, bro. This, Look, the fact that you, be fun. The fact that you walked her... My brother used to do shit like this. <laughs> <laughs> he would have women around that he would be fucking with. And he would bring them around his baby mama on some this my home girl. We just be riding together and smoking. You know, uh, uh, she be buying sacks from me. Fuck are you what? <laughs> <laughs> like dog, you was bold as shit. Like I ain't never just been around a woman that I was dealing with like that. With another woman I was dealing nah, with man. like that. Like, hey, look, yeah. let me go over here. I moved dumb. You moved dumb? I moved dumb. Dog, dog. Dog, y'all is bold. You can't mix the world. <laughs> man. I moved dumb. Like yeah. like 19 Scott, that was that was not a smart guy. Even 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 some of the boldness I've had was never on that level. I mean, <laughs> and now that I'm older, I'm like, dude, I was a fucking scumbag. You was. Yeah. This well, was like I was three too. years ago. <laughs> yeah, I was like, what? <laughs> was. You know what I'm, what you're about? I'm good now, ma'am. You think so? No. Okay, I'll just make sure. Um, Clearly, Jacob's in the same boat. <laughs> he's a scumbag too. <laughs> Jay, no, he's way worse of a scumbag. Yo, yeah, wh- dude, wh- listen to this shit. One time he was he was shitty, and he told a homegirl, "Yo, uh, I can't go out with you tonight. My dad's in the hospital." No, no, no. He drives to the fucking hospital. I got a band. And FaceTimes like like with the hospital in the background. The building. So you can see the hospital. (laughs) That was two weeks ago. That is dedicated. (laughs) That's dedicated, bro. 
If you that was, was that, the what, when he told Bini, me that shit, I was like, yo, what the you fuck's the matter with you? Dedicated to comedy. <laughs> <laughs> the way you was dedicated to that line, huh? yeah, you'll be on a, the road right now. You'd be I, have, I have abandonment issues, you know. Those are the things I was uh, doing. You can't nah. stop abandoning <laughs> bitches, dude. What are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, we well, got yeah. you got reverse abandonment, yeah, <laughs> dude. So, You're the Stockholm. Yeah, listen, I have problems. Not That's proud of crazy. It, but these are, I've done some shitty lying. I'm not judging you, though, because you've heard my stories. I've shitty, done. shitty lying. No, but you were a moments. kid. I wasn't a kid. You, I, I mean, you were 20. In my 20s. In your so 20s. Was he? I just turned 30. Was, I just got here. He was like 28. Here. Yeah, this was 28. So. This was late so, 20s. Yeah. <sighs> I, I remember I, us talking about mine this. was early, but I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. I done done some shit, so I'm a, I'm definitely not judging you. Yeah, this is like 27, like 28. That's, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's some wild shit, Jake. But well, look, you gotta. I feel like if you if you committed to that life, that's why Patrick don't know nothing about this. So look, if you committed, <laughs> you committed to that life. If you dedicated life, this much, you, know you, you got to do it. I, I had one time. Look, I had one time. I was like when I was younger in my twenties. I was cheating and I stayed the night. And this was back when they didn't have like. You know the technology they have now, so I told my girl I went to jail and I had that chase with the police. You know what I'm saying? And I went and literally went to the park and rolled around in the ground like it got got like leaves and shit. <laughs> no. So I can say, so I can say, you know what I'm saying? I got. I, <laughs> You're telling me that's worse than the hospital story? Honestly, Come on, dog. Come on. FaceTime is still kind of weird, dude. <laughs> no, that's what, that's like, worse. What's wrong with that's not worse than the hospital story. <laughs> it leaves in my hair. Because <laughs> you like, because you like, look, look where I'm at. No, no, no. Now, what if she would have called you back like five minutes after you left? But you're like, this is where I've been. Look. Yeah. <laughs> wow, dude. I mean, that's crazy. <laughs> that's committing to the bit, dude. Commitment oh, dude. to the bit. You got to. Pat is like, what the fuck is this episode? It is so wild, dude. It's so wild. Y'all revealed so much. And. You picked the, the one episode I'm not editing at all, dude. <laughs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> you let it all out. I don't give a Man. shit. Leave it all in. <laughs> yeah, life, all my dude. shit is old, so I'm good. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, this, the this statue of limitations. Yeah, Jacob, Jacob shit happened in 2019. This was, yeah. this was yeah. like really Jacob shit happened now. after COVID. It's happening, yeah. it's happening now. It's what is your, what's your situation now? It's it's up there. It's yeah. up, what is up oh, there? It's in the air. Are you single again? We're going, well, I mean. You're doing some things? No, we're technically we're, you're doing we're trying things. to figure it out. Yeah, you're doing some things. <laughs> we're technically trying to figure it out. <laughs> we're trying to so figure it out. You're doing some things. It's not good. It's not good. It's not great. But okay. you know, there's is I there care. Hope? Is there hope? I care. Uh, maybe. Do they watch the podcast? No. That's good. Are you sure? Okay. But they might this episode. You know, <laughs> just it's gonna be the one they watch. Not going well. <laughs> She's watching. Yeah, she is oh, watching. Dude, gonna... You know what? I, I hate when people get get into this conversation. They start asking personal questions like, "So are you dating more than one woman? Like, bro, are you trying? Whoa, to, who like, do you that? really want me to get like? Be, now people will get you. You'll you'll be surprised that people will be Who's, in content. No. Oh, you mean Vlad? Di- the Vlads? Yeah. Oh yeah, the Vlads. Oh, Uniformant. They'll start that's, diving yeah. all into your shit. You know. No, but that see that's the thing. Like I've I've like I still do like fucked up shit but i'm honest about it now yeah. like listen i'm like listen i'm gonna fuck around like i'm not marriage material i'm not like a good fucking boyfriend i'm okay. honest about it i'm like so listen so the last time you cheated you told that girl no not that time <laughs> <laughs> no i think he's trying honest to do right about now, Scott? The i don't like it he's not boyfriend <laughs> material <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I, no i think well, let's take it down on that because he's definitely not husband material. He's not boyfriend material. No, no, no. So that's what he's saying. Hang not on. right now. But I'm but you, trying you get, to be. He's, he's basically like Pee Wee Herman in The Big Adventure. He's a loner, Dottie. He's, the, the he's, a, he's a loner, Dottie. He's a rebel. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, you don't want to get involved with a guy like him. Yeah. Respect the line. What's the matter with you? He's trying to be husband true. Like, I'm trying no, to he's lose not. weight. You know? yeah, he's a, not at all? I'm not. You know? <laughs> not into that lifestyle at all? Not even trying. I will tell you I am, but I'm not. <laughs> That's wild, dude. How's this to be young, been? to be young though. Yeah. That's a it's a youth thing. Yeah. See, do you, do you do you hear these stories and you're like, I, I would have never heard. No, no part of you is like, damn, that sounds like it could have been fun. Patrick, no. you got married young? No, no, no. I got married uh, more, uh, 30. 30? 30, Yeah, that's young. That's good though. Yeah, I, I, I think getting married young is a good thing. Mm-hmm. I it? think if you're ready for it and you yeah. and you can. Uh-huh. You can function with that person. I think it's good because I, this is in my perspective as a person in their forties has been in, living in relationships. I think the commitment helps you. 
And if you can yeah. commit to that person and like stay there, it helps you kind of like stay grounded mm-hmm. and you kind of like growing with that person. But if you're not ready for it, you just commit to problems because now you got this person tied in with you. You look, I, 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 I you feel. You went to Panda Express before this? You went to Express. I stayed at a Holiday Inn Express, dog. You know what I'm saying? I feel enlightened. I feel enlightened. No, nah, even that line right there, if my girls watch this, so you understand the Holiday Inn Express? Because <laughs> <laughs> you showed this to stay at the house last night. <laughs> <laughs> Is that where you was? <laughs> <laughs> uh, walking in with a dirty t shirt. <laughs> God. You ever forget what you what the lie was? That's the whole thing. That's why I didn't lie. Like yeah. if I if I were, like if I was dating somebody and I wanted like to date somebody else, I would break up with them. I would never cheat on anybody. But like it might happen the same day, but I would break up with them <laughs> before hooking up with somebody else. Might not be no overlap per se. Like no, you know, yeah, no, no. Be, what yeah. Abraham Lincoln say? Like if you don't if you lie, you don't gotta remember what you said or something. You if know, you tell the truth, if you tell the truth, you don't have to remember yeah, what you said. Yo, doesn't that just like speak volumes of this guy's character right now? If you speak the truth, you've got to remember what you said. If you lie, you got to like forget. Now I feel like a real liar because I've never heard that quote. I'm like, yeah, what? I, mean, I don't think that was a sales pitch. <laughs> I think you got to tell realistic lies. Not that I'm condoning, you know what I'm saying? Well, fuck it. Uh, yeah, I think you got to tell realistic lies. So like when, when, it, when you go, and then I think, I think if you do it too Church. much, though. <laughs> <laughs> if you do it too much, eventually you're gonna get caught. Yeah, because you're gonna you're, lie. You're gonna lie too, too much. Sun. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, yeah, you're gonna get burned. Yeah. 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 But if I think if, if you're you talking one like a one-time thing, yeah, keep it. You know what I'm saying? Keep it short. Yeah, keep it short. Keep it short. Not a girl emergency. It's like a break of the glass thing. Mm. <laughs> you say what do you say? Like get the poison out. Really yeah, <laughs> it's a good confession. Get all the poison out. <laughs> Patrice, I'm shooting for you. <laughs> I don't know, dude. It's uh. That when it blows up, it's good. Like I'm, a, I'm a good self sabotager when it comes not to when relationships. Not when it blows up, is good. Yeah, because then I'm, I'm, good I'm glad it's over. Like it's kind of like you could, you just, good? You, you could have just ended it. I could have. Are you good with but breaking then up? With he would feel bad about that. Yeah. What if he did it prematurely? I wanted to be my fault. Are you good with breaking up with people? Sometimes, like nah. you can sit people only down the dudes. Nah. Only the dudes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, motherfucker, get your bitch ass up out of here. Nah. It depends. He's a bad breaker upper for sure, dude. It How about depends. you, Scott? Me? Are you a good breaker upper? Nah, I ghost. Just no contact? <laughs> <laughs> do you even like, do you, do you leave them on number. red? No. Like, you change numbers? I mean, I have, but. Dog. <laughs> that was tough. That's Patrick, get married. So, yeah. are you a good communicator? No, I was, a good, I was great. Good, I was good. Great right now. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, real quick. Now I'm not a piece of shit. I'm a great person now. But back then, you know, I don't believe you. I don't believe it either. Like, yeah. what do you, like as far as what? Like, all right, so I had to change my number this time <laughs> because I switched providers. Yeah, but you how could many, have kept your number? No, I could have. Yeah, you I'll could. tell you about that later. Okay. All right, but it's not—it's not cheating related. Nothing like that. I got you. But how long? How many numbers do y'all have of me? Y'all probably only got like one or one or two. Two. Yeah. You're one. literally Scott See? Ramos number two. It's been that long because I'm a good person. You know what's wild is I got this new phone, and initially when I got it, somebody was calling looking for Scott Ramos. And I was like, is Scott giving my number out tomorrow? <laughs> I mean, I have your like, number. Is, like, is he passing this? Is he putting this shit in raffles? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we're like, oh, Scott. <laughs> looking for Scott Ramos. <laughs> I'm like, never heard of him. <laughs> I'm, not a good, I'm not a good breaker upper. So what do you win? Uh, <laughs> No, I think he's just in debt. Yeah, I think he's signing up for shit, and not paying people. You're not nice with it when you when you when you break up with somebody. I'm not a I'm not good at it, so I normally don't do it. I normally do shit to make her break to up with it me. Up. Yeah, I've done that. Yeah, I, I, I do when, that. And Jacob's like you know think self sabotage. So like when she comes, that's what you call when that? she's ready. That's what the, that's, that's what not what you're doing. I call oh. it finding the easy out. Oh. Well, that's what I think. That's the medical term. Now we all understand. <laughs> no, <laughs> now we all get it. Yeah, and like you know when she so when she comes to you like hey this isn't working. Like, you know what? I think you're on to something. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't I heard a truer yeah. sentence today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you might be right. I think we do need some space. Uh, my so, dream breakup. I respect your intuition. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just my me. dream breakup scenario is like a Seinfeld episode where like they break up with him and he's like, yeah, okay, I'll be fine. I'll find somebody else. And like, yeah. he's just like unbothered by it. 
that's my dream scenario. No, you know what's wild like is no. <laughs> so like <Why>? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. sorry. <laughs> Overly dramatic. <laughs> yeah. Well, man, I don't know if it's because I'm a cancer or what, like what. <laughs> don't be but like, don't I, be like that. Don't are be you, that guy. Are you I, one of those? I, I am. I am. I am. You, I, you're about well, to like, I'm, 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 What look, is that? I'm, okay. I'm like overly sensitive at times. I feel like I so used to I be have a cancer to people. <laughs> that's the uh, diagnosis, Pat. Where that's are different. you? That's your Mexican. Toxic. The new yeah. the new cultural word for that is toxic. Late you're Latino. Toxic. Well, back then. You, they didn't call it toxic then. You, they would say you were cancerous. You were cancer. Or just an asshole. I used to get that. That's, that's, See, that's universal. I'm a Libra. Does that mean like I can't? I'm indecisive. Or what does that yes. mean? Yeah. Look, there you go. Libra is indecisive. It's a scale. What about this guy? What are you? Sagittarius. Oh. Terrible. Toxic. All day. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> toxic moment. What was that last one? One good Sagittarius. Um, I don't know who's born. But Scott Ramos. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't even think of him first. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what I thought of? That's how you know he ain't shit. JC. Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. You're welcome. He's a Sag? I think so. JC. His birthday is 10 days after mine. And Jay Z. That was a made up date, though. No. Nah. Yeah, that's man made, bro. We hey, can't, we can't I, use what was Sean Carter? December 3rd? December 4th. December 4th. 12 4. What about Pat? Pat? Virgo. Virgo. You a Virgo? Yeah. And well, don't say, I knew it. Because no, if you knew it, you I mean, would have said it before fact, I did. The fact that you blew your own it. back out, that makes sense. Because <laughs> they say Virgos are good in bed, you know, so. I'll take it. <laughs> I'm just toxic. Yeah, Why it. am I getting this shit in? <laughs> they, they literally call you Sagittarius. I've, I've seen people post I've that. I've referred to myself as a walking terrorist. So, so it goes sure. correct. The walking you know who you are. Dude, I'm a walking at 11. You know who you are. Yeah, I, I fantasize about having good breakups. <laughs> I know. I'll right? be, be all in my feelings. Like, you know, I'm just going to say this. Hey, it's not, you know, when I, I feel this way and I think, you know, I'm, I'm going to have this long, drawn out speech. And it never goes that way. It always goes in a toxic <laughs> why manner. Fuck, shut like, the fuck up, man. Like, why are you fuck doing, you. like, why are you acting like this? Why am I acting like what? <laughs> <laughs> Expand on You're that. You're just like, being what? short with me. Am I being short or did I just answer your question? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, man. Is this how you're going to act? When you start doing the dickhead shit? Oh, it's amazing. <laughs> Is this how you're going to act? I don't understand. How am I acting? You're asking questions I'm answering. I don't, I don't get it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Is that a long enough answer for you? Wait, let's role play. Try to break no, up a no, quasi. I mean, no, this is... <laughs> Try to break up a quasi. Yeah. Let's yeah, see who's man. better at it. <laughs> <laughs> better, at, better at being toxic. All my numbers. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh. You see, you see it's a break off. <laughs> you see this? <laughs> <laughs> That's a great American break off. <laughs> that's a that's a spinoff right there. Do the man homie bro presents oh, man. the break off. <laughs> Who's better at breaking up? <laughs> Your pun game ten. Yeah. <laughs> Dog, that's that's wild because you could do that at the show. You could put two couples on there. You wanna break up with your girl? You wanna break up with your girl? All right, we're gonna see who does it better. Go. That's so funny. Time. We just came up with a show and concept. Who, and who's the judge? Great American. Yeah. Who's the judge? <laughs> Next show at Upstage. <laughs> Great American <laughs> break off, dude. Oh, uh, that's gold. It's a room full of Call us. It's a room full of couples in here. It won't be like that when the show's that's over. That's so funny, oh. man. It's called the break off. Yeah, man. Listen, that's... I don't want to take my boots off, Quasi. What are you gonna do about it? <laughs> And that's you don't want to be in here then. <laughs> <laughs> no way I would be pleading with you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Maybe it's time for you to go, Jacob. <laughs> Maybe that's God's sign. You know what I'm saying? It's God telling you. Yeah. Is this not effort? I drove all the way over here to see you. <laughs> <laughs> is it effort or is it selfishness because you don't want to take your shoes off and respect my boundaries? I'll tell you what. Don't even worry about it. Don't even take your shoes off. You can <laughs> You can leave. You know what I'm saying? So what you got going on today? <laughs> I, got to, I got to wash my sofa. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, I'm busy. You know what I'm saying? My microwave need cleaning. You know what I'm saying? I got stuff to do. Don't worry about me. It's some nacho cheese on there. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I just realized. No, don't worry about me. I'll be fine. I got yeah, stuff to man. do. 
I got to make some ice anyway. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I got shit to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, let me tell you. I got to fix my car. <laughs> when I'm done fixing good. this car. <laughs> yeah. You're going to be left on red from there on in. A- <laughs> A.K.A. Scott Ramos. You know what I'm saying? The Scott Ramos special. Oh, you, you try man. texting me talking about, I just want to let you know I made it. Who are you talking to? <laughs> <laughs> because I'm confused. I don't. I don't know. I don't know why you thought I cared. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> dude. Cold, dude. Cold. Oh my god. Oh man. And that's what it's about, folks. Yeah, that's how you do it. You yeah. know what I'm saying? We can wrap it up there, man. That was fun. Quads, thanks for hanging out, bro. Uh, well, this will be out this week. What do you got coming up? I, was, I thought I was gonna have to do this like a breakup. I was like, "So what y'all about to do?" <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, so what, what else got you got going on today? <laughs> <laughs> what you got planned after this? Um, <laughs> um, show wise, man, uh, we got the show upstage. It's so like a teachers, um, like bad kids, bad teachers with Lacey. Um, it's like me, AP. I think C Wayne's on there. I think George Rosales on there. Oh yeah. Um, I got some other shit. And I don't mean to call it shit, uh, but I probably have to look at my calendar. You know what I'm saying? Uh, just, uh, but that's the one thing I can think of, like for sure, for sure, I got coming up. Um, How can they find you online? IG, all that stuff. Still King Quasito. Um, it's Quasito. Yeah, I'm gonna spell it for you. You look. I feel like your demographic. You yeah. know what I'm saying? They need this. <laughs> they don't uh, spell. <laughs> <laughs> They put the ill in illiterate. <laughs> <laughs> Quasito, K W A S I T O, because I identify as Mexican online. So, uh, Quasito, damn, Patrick, none of these jokes are working tonight. No, I uh, think it's funny. You didn't laugh. Oh, sorry, man. Uh, <laughs> he just smiles. <laughs> hmm. oh, okay, I'm going to keep that one, though. I'm going to keep that one. Yeah, um, tough one. crowd tonight. I tough crowd. Oh, we've been. It's, I've been throwing out bangers, dude, but nothing. I've nothing been around. acknowledging. Hopefully, you're laughing at home because we're having a yeah. good time here. Hopefully, this is one of the most last per minute episode ever. LPMs. Yeah, LPMs. <laughs> Even um, they is that what they call them? LPM? <laughs> Sounds too much like SPM for me. Yeah. Ooh. BLM. But we don't. <laughs> st- stop that, Jacob. <laughs> stop that. <Stupid laughs> uh, what you got going on? September 19th, we got the, the Clay, the Big Clay Benefit Show. That's in September. I was trying to think of August stuff. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, I don't got shit, dude. I'm dead. <clears throat> yeah, shout out to Big Clay, man. Uh, you said September 19th. September yeah. 19th, upstairs, Thursday, Big Clay. R.I.P. Uh, hey, you guys, all, all the money's gonna go to the crazy. Lord. Is it the crazy eight or hot? Hot What's, damn, hot hot damn comedy show at the LOL coming up, right? Yeah, yeah. Dude, he's got it for the rest of the year. Yeah, man, I got a new monthly show at the Laugh Out Loud Comedy Club. Bam, bam, bam. Uh, they're giving me. Bam, bam. Uh, yeah, a monthly show until the end of the year, and then we're going to evaluate the numbers. Uh, hot damn comedy show. Uh, this month, we're going to do it uh, Wednesday the 14th, 7.30. Yeah. Uh, $10 tickets. Uh, it's a fire lineup. You got people from uh, the Mothership, people you've seen on Naked and Afraid, people you've seen at uh, Austin on YouTube, on uh, OnlyFans. Uh, Walmart. Pe- people doing H-E-B. stuff. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, they, be, they be doing stuff. Uh, babacoolcore.com for the tickling all that stuff and then uh, support that show That's that need your, your support on that one and then I'll, I'll be around I got stuff uh, IG at your homie Pat and again babacoolcore.com uh, Jakey what do you get? Uh, Jakey5 underscore on Instagram uh, August 16th uh, me and some friends will be with uh, Big Baby Green from Houston, Texas I think we're doing a roast battle uh, Shout out to Big Baby, man. That's my boy. Yeah, and he then very, he very funny too. And then August thirty first, he's also around. I'll be with uh, Hank Garza for another uh, Alamo City roast battle edition. So I got some roast coming up, pretty cool. Um, Jiggy five underscore on Instagram, uh, the station co op. Shout out Tandem, and yeah, yeah. Shout out subscribe, to Hank like, share, do the man homie, bro. You don't have to be a do the man homie, bro, to subscribe, like, and share either. You could just be like an average Joe. Just like the people from that movie when they worked out at the gym. Average Joes. Dodgeball. Peace.